The original story contains content that is not safe for work and may not be suitable for all audiences. If you are an underage or overly sensitive individual, I suggest you to just click off the video. Enjoy at your own risk. The forehead of your robot. TikTok is a Chinese social media app that allows you to watch short clips of videos, and it also allows you to record yourself. Basically you're likely to find videos of dancing, memes or something like that. It's a pretty long description to even explain. Well, let's say it was made for fun or something. I've seen animations in the app and all such. TikTok is quite a lot to even explain. Many have known it for its untalented nature, perhaps in original positions and all such. But no, that's not what I'm actually talking about. I may not be a huge fan of TikTok, but it rather has a pretty dark side to the social media app. No, it isn't like the classic weird side of YouTube, with videos such as I Feel Fantastic or Shea St. John, no, the dark side of TikTok is more horrifying if you think about it. Last year, I was surfacing around my phone. I normally watch TikTok videos on the internet. Yeah, maybe I'm wasting my time. But that's what I do whenever I'm bored as fuck honestly. Anyway, what was I going to talk about? Oh yeah, I actually searched on the internet that there were numerous cases of child predators roaming around TikTok, and how kids should stay safe. It's pretty disturbing if you think about it. There are other times where people have promoted criminal activities on TikTok. One of my friends actually found a video of somebody showcasing their firearms, and threatening to actually open fire at their school. That person who did it was later arrested for doing it. Basically, there have been instances where people have found very weird stuff when they go to the home section. If not, creepy, disturbing and absolutely terrible stuff you can actually find on TikTok. We'll get to that later on. I went to the app to see the home section, just to explore what could be lurking on TikTok. There were a few normal videos here and there. Especially funny memes, however I've seen some graphic stuff. So what have I witnessed on the app? Let me tell you some examples of the weird things I have witnessed. One of the first on videos I've seen on TikTok was that of a man wearing a Batman mask while taking a shit and explaining what he actually ate. I am not fucking joking, this was actually on TikTok. People just have weird fetishes for this shit. Speaking of fetishes, another video shows a fat man rubbing his belly. Anyway, we'll get away from things like that to explain more. A very uncanny video of a man who appeared to dress as Sonic. Well, he painted his face blue, and the creepy eyes is just, no. A video of I feel fantastic, nothing else. It was quite an interesting experience at the first part. But there have been more videos when I keep loading my screen. Still some few good and normal videos you'd normally see on TikTok, but I've seen some more when I browsed on the website for like 6 hours. Yes, I have taken breaks, lunch breaks, restroom breaks, dinner breaks, etc. But, we have the more disturbing side. 1. A video showing a man getting executed by the guillotine, which looks to be a video recorded around the 1920s or some archaic time period. It didn't show the head chopping part, but it was disturbing. 2. A video of a man getting executed by the cartel. I knew it was a cartel execution video from the language. But the man who is getting executed seemed like somebody from the United States or Canada. 3. An image of an actual animal slaughterhouse. 4. A woman feeding a living rabbit to her pet snake, and she watches the snake eating the rabbit alive. While that happened, she films the entire thing. Something that just annoys me, especially the fact I had a rabbit once who looked like the one in the video. 5. Probably the most disturbing video I've seen on the platform. It showed a man on a boat, throwing a live puppy into a lake. The puppy appears to be drowning, while the man is laughing hysterically, and even mocks the animal while it's struggling in agony. At the end of the video, he was yelling racial slurs at the camera. What I just explained was my experience on the app. It's safe to say you should always be careful wherever you go on TikTok's homepage, it may potentially be unsafe for minors to go on there. Maybe for an uneasy individual who doesn't like these sick things. It's a crazy and uncomfortable experience going on TikTok. 
its moderation can be pretty poor, and it's probably not going to take down the unsettling and gruesome content going around. I think that's the end of my experience. I still use TikTok to this day, but I'll never go on the homepage. I only will look it up for the memes.